Danielle Pricing. I am 28 years old. I'm in my 28th week of my first pregnancy. I am an ESL teacher as well as a yoga instructor. I've been teaching both for the past five years. Right now, you know, I'm in the process of deciding do I want to go the more natural route, not having an epidural, letting the baby come when he comes, versus inducing and being almost certain that my husband will be able to make it. My husband is a professional athlete and he is not necessarily, his schedule does not necessarily permit him to be there the 10 days before the birth and then the five days after my scheduled due date. So we had decided that we were going to induce labor and then I would have an epidural and go through that process. However, I am I really do not want to have a c-section and I realize that when you do induce labor and have an epidural it definitely leads to a higher chance of having a c-section. Having it vaginally and naturally without the drug, without inducing, it, it makes the birth a lot easier on the baby as well as it makes it easier on me. Your body is in a lot less stress and the baby's in a lot less stress as well so I feel like to me it just makes sense it's also you can make yourself more comfortable you can walk around and you don't necessarily have to be confined to a hospital bed which I am not excited to be confined um, I just feel like in the end it's a lot less wear and tear on your body and it really helps the baby. The pregnancy has been really good so far. I've, I don't really have any complaints about it. It's been fairly easy. I didn't have much morning sickness. However, maybe around 26 weeks I started getting a severe kind of rib pain and pubic pain. So with that I've been working with Berlin Chiropractics to help me alleviate some of that pain which has really been beneficial. My husband and I are interested in having a doula. We originally had an interview to doula a couple months ago and decided that we weren't interested and in the past couple months we kind of changed our mind on that fact and decided that we were really interested in having a doula simply because he is a professional athlete and he's not necessarily available before or after the birth and to me it's comforting to have someone who I can call, ask questions and the doula obviously is not replacing my husband being there but um, being there to kind of walk us through and educate us on the whole process as well as you know neither of us have ever done this before we have no idea what to expect and it's in our minds it's comforting to have someone who has done this hundreds of times and can just kind of take us through it and make it easier all the discomforts that have started in the past couple weeks that I've really um, not loved about pregnancy and you know it just kind of takes a toll on your body I feel like everything is different everything has changed and you know I don't absolutely love it but <laughs> in the end I know it'll be it'll be worth it <laughs>